to look at what is a limitation. Tunataka tuangalie uh, kizuizi ni nini. What is a limitation? Kizuizi ni kitu gani? A limitation is that thing which does not allow you to maximize your potential to attain or to achieve or to reach your dreams, your visions, your goals or your destiny. Yaani kizuizi ni kile kitu kinachokupinga wewe usifikilie uwezo wako kamilifu. Ni kile kitu kinachozuia ndoto yako, kinachozuia maono yako na kuzuia hata hatima yako. Anything that stops you on your way to maximizing your potential to attain your dreams or your destiny or your vision is a limitation. Chochote kinachokuzuia wewe usifikilie uwezo wako kamili kinachokuzuia usifikilie ndoto zako maono yako na malengo yako kitu hicho ni sawa kuitwa kipingamizi a limitation Pinga, can therefore be pingamizi inaweza kuwa a barrier eh kizuizi a hindrance eh mahali umekwamishwa a boundary mpaka a yoke nira a cage ama mahali chumba umefungiwa a peg ama kiguzo an obstruction kizuizi a prevention e mahali umepingwa a hedge or a wall ukuta mkubwa ama kuwekewa uzio mkubwa that defines restriction ambao inaelezea ile hali ya kukandamizwa na kuzuiliwa it restricts you inakupinga wewe for example kwa mfano a car speed governor eh kidhibiti mwendo cha gari restricts the car to a certain speed kina izuia gari ifikie uh, kasi ya mwendo fulani it prevents the car Ina to a certain speed inaizuia ile gari isipite mwendo fulani ama kasi fulani even though the car was built for much higher speed ingawaje gari yenyewe iliundwa na muundo wa kutembea ya mwendo wa juu zaidi but cannot move faster lakini kwa sababu ya kidhibiti mwendo haiwezi kwenda kasi zaidi than the limit kuliko kile kiwango kilichowekewa amen amen it is an act of imposing restrictions ni kitendo ama tendo la kumwekea mtu kizuizi that is a limitation hiyo ndio kizuizi ama pingamizi amen amen praise the lord amen anything chochote that stops you kinachokuzuia wewe on your way to your destiny kwa njia yako ya kuelekea hatima yako to your dreams kuelekea ndoto yako is a limitation hicho ni kipingamizi i may ask you nami ninakuuliza wewe what could be that limitation or that thing that restricts you to maximize your potential je ni kitu gani hiki maisha yako ambacho kimekuzuia kimekupinga usifikilie uwezo wako na ndoto zako what is that thing je ni kitu gani hiki which does not allow you ambacho hakikuruhusu wewe to maximize your potential kwamba ukaweze kufikia uwezo wako timilifu to maximize your potential kufikia uwezo wako mkamilifu to reach your dreams uifikie ndoto yako how many of you have dreams wangapi wenu wana ndoto hapa dreams of your life ndoto za maisha yako amen amen how many of you have a destiny in their lives wangapi wana hatima maishani mwao they have a goal wana malengo they have a vision wana maono amen 
Amen. Now, what is that thing? Je, ni nini hiki? Because that thing which prevents you Hicho kinacho kuzuia wewe to maximize your potential kwamba usifikie uwezo wako mtimilifu is a limitation. Hicho ni kizuizi. It is a limitation. Ni kizuizi. That thing which does not allow you Hicho kitu ambacho hakikuruhusu to maximize your potential kwamba ufikilie uwezo wako mkamilifu to achieve your talent kwamba ufikie malengo yako to reach your ministry kwamba uifikie huduma yako to reach your calling ufikie mwito wako your dreams and visions ndoto zako na maono yako that is a limitation hicho ni kizuizi it could be a weakness huenda ikawa ni udhaifu an attack of satan ama uvamizi wa shetani a spell of witchcraft ama ni lana ya adui a yoke nira which has been cast upon you ambayo imetupwa kwako wewe a hindrance kizuizi which has been imposed upon you ambapo kimewekwa mbele zako listen sikiza in the year 2020 mwaka huu 2020 That limitation kizuizi hicho shall be broken down kitavunjika give the lord a mighty hand patie bwana yesu makofu that limitation hicho kizuizi it shall be broken down kitavunjika vunjika hallelujah hallelujah praise the lord amen whatever limiter cho kizuizi chochote that the devil has imposed upon your life ambacho adui ameweka maishani mwako it's going to be broken in the name of Jesus. Inaenda kuvunjika kwa jina la Yesu. Oh give the Lord a mighty hand. Patie bwana Yesu makofi mazuri. Philippians chapter number 4. Kitabu cha Wafilipo mlango ni wa 4. Verse 13. Na tunasoma mstari wa 13. The Bible says I can do all things through Christ which strengtheneth me kwamba nayaweza mambo yote katika yeye anitiaye nguvu amen amen praise the lord amen paul says paulo anasema i can do all things kwamba nayaweza mambo yote how many things mambo mangapi how many things paul says i can do all things Paulo anasema nayaweza mambo yote not some things wala si baadhi ya mambo but all things ila mambo yote not half of them wala si mambo nusu no hapana i can do all things kwamba nayaweza mambo yote meaning inamaanisha there is no limitation for me ya kwamba hakuna kizuizi mbele yangu. Oh give the Lord a mighty hand. Patie bwana Yesu makofi. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I can do all things. Nayaweza mambo yote. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I can do all things. Nayaweza mambo yote. Through Christ. Kupitia Kristo. Which strengtheneth me. Yeye anitiaye nguvu. He acknowledges. Yeye anatambua. The one who is in him. Yeye aliye ndani yake the source of that the, the grace that he operates in le chimbuko la neema inayofanya kazi ndani yake he acknowledges the strength that he he receives from christ anatambua nguvu anazopokea toka kwa kristo he says it's no longer me anasema sio mimi tena it's not my doing si kwa matendo yangu i can do all things mimi nayaweza mambo yote not some things si mambo kadhaa but all things ila mambo yote through christ kupitia kristo which strengtheneth me yeye anitiaye nguvu may god strengthen you in the year 2020 naye bwana akutie nguvu mwaka 2020 may jesus strengthen you in the year 2020 yesu akutie nguvu mwaka 2020 May the Holy Spirit strengthen you in the year 2020. Roho mtakatifu akuwezeshe mwaka 2020. May you speak like Paul. Unene kama Paulo. I can do 
all things. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. May you declare like Paul. I can do all things. Through Christ. Who strengtheneth me. Lift up your hands and give the Lord a mighty hand. Hallelujah. Amen. By the fact of the power that raised Christ from the dead. Kwa hakika ya ule uwezo ulio mfufua Kristo toka kwa wafu. Which is in me. Ulio ndani yangu. Paul says. Paul anasema. I can do all things. Na ya weza mambo yote. Oh give the Lord a mighty hand. Pebwa na Yesu makofi mazuri. By the fact of the spirit of God. Who quickened Christ on the third day and he rose again. Mm, kwa hakika ya ule ukweli wa ile nguvu iliyomfufua Yesu siku ya tatu. By the fact of the spirit of God. Kwa ile hakika ya roho wa Mungu. Who is in me? Aliye ndani yangu. Who quickened Christ? Aliyemhuisha Kristo and rose him from the dead. Akamfufua toka kwa wafu. On the third day. Siku ya tatu. I can do all things. Hayaweza mambo yote. Oh, give the Lord a mighty hand. Pe bwana Yesu makofi mazuri. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Amen. He says I can do all things. Anasema na yaweza mambo yote. Through Christ. Kupitia Kristo. Which strengtheneth me. Anitiae nguvu. By that anointing kwa mafuta hayo which is upon me yaliyo juu yangu i can do all things naweza mambo yote he says i realize asema natambua there is some power in me kuna uwezo ndani yangu which is not limited ambao hauna mipaka oh give the lord a mighty hand pe yesu makofi mazuri there is a power in me kuna uwezo ndani yangu which knows no boundaries ambao haujui mipaka yoyote which knows no hindrances haujui kizuizi chochote which knows no yoke haujui nira yoyote which knows no limitation haujui kipingamizi chochote there is a power in me kuna uwezo ndani yangu and by that power na kwa uwezo huo which is in me leo ndani yangu i can do all things hayaweza mambo yote oh give the lord a mighty hand he bwana yesu makofi mazuri hallelujah hallelujah praise the lord amen the bible says biblia inasema and jesus came back to the disciples yesu akawarudia wanafunzi wake in chapter number matthew 28 from verse 18 mathayo 28 mstari wa 18 and he said all power in heaven and on earth is given to me akasema nguvu zote mbinguni na duniani zimepewa mimi i give this power to you also na uwezo huu ninawapeni nyinyi i give you this power also na wapeni uwezo huu by the fact of that power kwa hakika ya nguvu hizi by the fact of that power kwa bayana ya nguvu hizi by the fact of that anointing kwa hakika ya upako huu by the fact of that spirit kwa upako kwa hakika ya roho huu there shall be no limitation hakutakuwa na pingamizi maisha There shall be no limitation in your life. Hakutakuwa na pingamizi maishani mwako. There shall be no limitation in your life. Hakutakuwa na pingamizi maishani mwako. What Jesus did. Kile Yesu alifanya. You can also do it. Hata wewe unaweza fanya. What God can do. Kile Mungu anaweza fanya. You can also do it. Unaweza fanya. What God can do. Kile Mungu anaweza fanya. You can also do it. Hata wewe unaweza kufanya. Oh give the Lord a mighty hand. Atie Yesu makofi. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Now listen. Sikiza. I want to ask you one question. Nataka nikuulize swali moja. There are three, but I will begin with the first question. Ni matatu maswali yenyewe nitaanza na la kwanza. My dear viewer, tazamaji wangu. Listen to this three questions. Yasikize maswali haya matatu. The first question is, la kwanza ni, has the devil already imposed his limitations against your life? J Shetani tayari amewekeza vikwazo vyake kinyume na maisha yako? Has the devil already imposed his limitations upon your life? Je, shetani amekuwekea tayari vikwazo kinyume na maisha yako? Has he told you already? Je, ashakuambia tayari? You cannot do this. Huwezi kufanya hiki. You mean you? Wewe. You cannot build a house in Mombasa. Hapa Mombasa hutajenga. You mean you wewe you can't buy a car wezi kuinunua gari 
Amen. Amen. Has the devil already imposed his limitations upon you? Je, shetani tayari amekuwekea mipaka kinyume na maisha yako? That you cannot be anybody great in your life. Kwamba hauwezi kuwa chochote kikuu maishani. That you can never succeed in your life. Kwamba hutafanikiwa maishani mwako. Amen. Amen. Has he already imposed his limitations upon your life? Je, tayari amewekeza vikwazo vyake kinyume na maisha yako? In the year 2020. Mwaka wa 2020. Every limitation. Kila kizuizi. That the devil has imposed on your life. Ambacho pepo ameweka maishani mwako. Shall be crushed down. Kitasagwa chini. It shall be crushed down. Kitavunjika chini. It shall be broken down. Kitavunjwa chini. It shall be broken down. Kitavunjwa chini. Give the Lord a mighty hand. Ni bwana Yesu makofi. What is that limitation that the enemy has imposed upon you? Ni pingamizi gani hiyo ambayo adui amekuwekea? You mean you mean you can preach also? Ah, you you yeah, can't wewe, preach. Wewe utaweza kuhubiri kweli ya. Wewe can't. huwezi, huwezi. huwezi. They have said you will give a word on, on Wednesday in the fellowship. You can't. Utahubiri. Tell them you can't. Kwa ushirika hutaweza waambie mapema mpigie simu kiongozi. Huwezi. Listen. Sikiza. Paul says Paulo anasema, I can do all things through Christ Titia Christo, which strengthens me and oh, give the Lord a mighty heart Yesu hallelujah. hallelujah I want you to realize Taka utambue. there is a divine power of resurrection in your life Kuna uweza wa ufufuo ndani ya maisha yako There is a divine power of God in your life Kuna uweza mkubwa wa kiungu ndani ya maisha yako Which can enable you Unaweza kukuwezesha to be, to be what God has created you to be Kuwa kile Mungu amekuumba uwe maisha Oh give the Lord a mighty hand Pe bwana Yesu makofi masikio Hallelujah Hallelujah Praise the Lord Amen What is that limitation that the enemy has imposed on your life. Nikizuizi gani hicho adui amekuwekea maishani. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I thank God you are in the right place. Nashukuru Mungu uko mahali pa sawa. You are in the right year. Uko kwa mwaka wa sawa. Because that limitation maana kizuizi hicho shall be broken down. Kitavunjika kwa I jina. see you. Na kuona progressing in your life. Ukiendelea maisha. I'm saying I'm seeing you progressing in your life. Nasema na kuona ukiendelea maisha. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. That thing, hicho kitu, that prevention, hiyo kizuizi, that limitation, hiyo pingamizi, which the devil has imposed on your life. Ambayo pepo ameiweka maishani mwako. It will be no more after this service. Haitaonekana tena baada ya ibada hii. Oh give the Lord a mighty hand. Bwana Yesu makofi mazuri. Second question. Swali la pili. Have people imposed their limitations against you? Je, watu wanadamu wamekuwekea kizuizi kinyume na maisha yako Have people or your critics imposed their limitations about your life about you eh watu ama wale wanaokushtumu je wameshaweka vizuizi tayari kinyume na maisha yako There are those doubters who say you can't bwana Kuna wale watu walio na mashaka juu yako wanasema huwezi The doubters when they look at you they define you wale wenye mashaka wakikuangalia hivi tayari wanaanza kukufafanua hallelujah hallelujah those people who try to discourage you wale watu wanaojaribu kukuvunja moyo those people wale watu they are trying to impose a limitation on your life wanajaribu kabisa waweke kizuizi maishani mwako how many have been discouraged Wangapi wamevunjwa moyo? Just show up your hand. You Iyo. have been discouraged in one way or another. Kwa njia moja au nyingine umevunjwa moyo. Now listen. Sikiza. Those people who discourage you. Hao watu walio kuvunja moyo. They are trying to impose their limitation upon you. Wanajaribu kukuwekea wewe vizuizi. Hallelujah. Amen. But tell them. Waambie hivi. It is too late. 
wamechelewa in the year 2020 mwaka 2020 i am a person of no limitation mimi ni mtu asiye na kizuizi i am a person of no limitations ni mtu asiye na vizuizi oh give the lord a mighty hand pe bwana yesu makofi mazuri you know there are people unajua kuna watu who always look down on others ambao kila siku wanawadhalalisha wengine they despise others wanawadharau watu they look poorly on other people eh hey, wanawaangalia wakiwahurumia watu they judge them wanawahukumu they say wanasema they cannot be anything great hawawezi kuwa kitu chochote kikubwa you mean that person unaniambia mtu fulani he cannot be somebody hawezi kuwa chochote listen sikiza the destiny of your life hatima ya maisha yako is not in the hands of your doubters amen haiko mikononi mwa wanao kutilia mashaka kama umesikia vizuri mpigie bwana yesu makofi haleluya the destiny of your life hatima ya maisha yako is not in the hands of your doubters haimo mikononi mwanao kutilia mashaka the destiny of your life hatima ya maisha yako is in the hands of the living god iko mikononi mwa mungu anayeishi haleluya amen it is in the hands of the living god i mikononi mwa mungu aishie haleluya amen i want to encourage you nataka nikutie moyo haleluya haleluya you are doubters wanao kutilia mashaka you are critics wanao kushtumu they have no final word over your life wala hawana neno la mwisho juu ya maisha yako they have no final say over your life hawana usemi wa mwisho juu ya maisha yako god has the final say over your life mungu pekee ana usemi wa mwisho juu ya maisha yako lift up your hands and give the lord a mighty hand inua mikono mpe yesu makofi mazuri They have no final say over your life. Hawana neno la mwisho juu ya maisha yako. My dear viewer, tazamaji wangu, you are doubters. Wanaokushuku. Those people who look at you poorly. Wale wanaokuangalia wakikudhalalisha. Those who despise you. Wanaokudharau. They don't have the final say over your life. Tena hawana neno la mwisho juu ya maisha yako. They don't have the final say over your destiny. Hawana neno la mwisho juu ya hatima yako. It is God. Ni Mungu tu. And God alone. Mungu pekee. Who has the final say over your life? Aliye na neno la mwisho juu ya maisha yako. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Have people imposed their limitations Je, on your life watu wamekuwekea vizuizi maishani mwako have they imposed their limitations over your life je wameweka vizuizi vyao maishani mwako it doesn't matter who they are haijalishi wao ni wakina nani could be your teachers pengine ni walimu wako they spoke negative about you waliongea vibaya kukuhusu they said you will be nothing in life walisema hutakuwa chochote maishani but i'm here to declare to you ila niko hapa nikutangazie as long as you are in christ bora uko ndani ya kristo yesu and christ is in you na yesu yuko ndani yako there yangu. is no more limitation in your life hakuna tena kizuizi maishani mwako hallelujah hallelujah there is no more limitation in your life hakuna kizuizi tena maishani mwako the power that raised Christ from the dead ile nguvu iliyomfufua Yesu toka kwa wafu will give you victory over your limitations itakupa wewe ushindi dhidi ya vizuizi vyako oh, give the lord a mighty hand pe Yesu makofi the power of Jesus Christ uweza wa Yesu Kristo which brought him from the dead uliyomfufua toka kwa wafu it will give you victory utakupa wewe ushindi over your challenges na dhidi ya changamoto zako over your limitations dhidi ya vipingamizi vyako over your hindrances dhidi ya vizuizi vyako Paul says Paulo anasema I can do all things oh na yaweza mambo yote I can do all things na yaweza mambo yote I can preach naweza hubiri I can heal the sick naweza ponya wagonjwa I can raise the dead 
Ufufua wafu I can do all things Naweza fanya yote Hallelujah 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 I can be what God wants me to be Naweza kuwa kile Mungu anataka niwe I can be what God wants me to be Naweza kuwa kile Mungu anataka niwe I can do all things Naweza mambo yote No devil can limit me Hakuna pepo wa kunizuia No witch can limit me Hakuna mchawi wa kunizuia Hallelujah Hallelujah Praise the Lord Hallelujah I want you today Nataka wewe leo to be with those limitations pambane na hivyo vizuizi which was spoken against your destiny vilivyonenwa kinyume na hatima yako which was spoken against your life vilivyonenwa kinyume na maisha yako which was spoken against your marriage vilivyonenwa kinyume na ndoa yako i want you today nataka wewe leo to get mad ukasirike to get crazy well uwe wazimu to get holy anger yani upate ha- hasira takatifu against those limitations kinyume na hivyo vizuizi which people have imposed upon your life ambavyo watu wameviweka kinyume na maisha yako hallelujah hallelujah could be your grandmother pengine nyanya yako imposed her limitation upon you alipanda vi, 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 vipingamizi vyake maishani mwako could be your auntie pengine shangazi could be your grandfather ama babu yako could be your uncle ama mjomba could be your husband ama mumeo it doesn't matter who he is haijalishi yeye ni nani could be your parents pengine wazazi today leo i want you to arise nataka uinuke i want you to arise simama my dear viewer tazamaji i want you to arise nataka uamke against those limitations when you men are pingamizi people have imposed watu wameziweka against your life you men are shaya yako break them down sifunjilie mbali break them down funjilie mbali the power of resurrection kwa uweza wa ufufuo which is in you iliyo ndani yako by the spirit of god roho wa mungu who is in you aliye ndani yako by the anointing of god pako wa mungu is upon your life ye juu ya maisha yako rise up today inuka leo break every limitation funja kila kikwazo break every limitation funja pia pingamizi break every limitation funja kila mipaka the lord almighty ha batie bwana yesu makofu fi mazuri You were created for progress not for limitation. Umeumbwa ufanikiwe wala si kwa kuzuiliwa. Aya, you know what? Najua nini? Your God is a God of progress. Mungu wako ni Mungu wa maendeleo. Your God is a God of progress. Mungu wako ni Mungu wa maendeleo and his children na wanawe pia are children of progress ni wana wa maendeleo pia if you believe you are a child of god kama unaamini mwana wa mungu born of the spirit aliyezaliwa na roho baptized in the holy ghost tiwa utabatizwa na roho mtakatifu washed by his blood katakaswa na damu yake you are a child of progress wewe ni mwana wa maendeleo you are a child of progress mwana wa maendeleo you are a child of progress mwana wa kuendelea you are a woman of progress mama wa maendeleo you are a father of progress baba wa maendeleo you are a brother of progress ndugu wa maendeleo your sister progress dada wa maendeleo in business kwa biashara progress maendeleo in business biashara progress maendeleo in office work ofisini progress maendeleo family wise kwa jamii progress tena maendeleo everywhere kila mahali progress maendeleo progress maendeleo progress maendeleo no limitation hakuna kizuizi no limitation hakuna pingamizi let no more limitation hakuna pingamizi no more limitation hakuna pingamizi amen amen How many believe? Ngapi wanaamini that they are God's children? Kwamba wao ni wana wa Mungu. For as many as believed in him. Na jinsi wengi walivyomwamini. They were given the power. Walipewa uwezo to be called the sons of God. Kuitwa wana wa Mungu. Sons of God. Wana wa Mungu are sons of no limitation.